the Holy Spirit works in the life of an unbeliever and a sinner too. Who? Are you shocked? Don't go yet. Good day, everyone. You're welcome to Real Princess Foundation TV. And today, we'll be talking on how to receive the power of the Holy Spirit. But before we go further, do well to subscribe to our YouTube channel. <sighs> Reading and hearing about the Holy Spirit is not enough. You must desire and pray to receive him into your life. Because before Jesus went back to heaven, he promised to send the Holy Spirit to every one of his followers. God has promised us to give us the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is for everyone. Wow. Is the Holy Spirit for me? Is that your question? Yes, the Holy Spirit is for you. Who now is the Holy Spirit? The Holy Spirit is the third person in the Godhead. He is with God, the Father, and the Son, Jesus Christ, from the beginning in creation. When God created heaven and earth, He was there. Genesis chapter 1, verse 2. The Holy Spirit has the same nature and character as God the Father. The Holy Spirit works in the life of a believer and a sinner too. How does the Holy Spirit work in the sinner? For the sinner, the Holy Spirit makes sinner to hear the gospel of Jesus Christ. It makes the sinner to know that he is guilty before God. And it also makes the sinner to help him to pray. The Holy Spirit works in a sinner and makes a sinner to receive Jesus Christ as the Lord and personal Savior. How does the Holy Spirit work for the believer? The Holy Spirit guides as he speaks to us. The Holy Spirit help a believer in the journey of life. The Holy Spirit help us to understand the Bible and its teaching. The Holy Spirit comforts you in time of sorrow. He also go with you through all troubles like sicknesses, failure. He was always there. He always assure you of the Lord's abiding presence. The Holy Spirit makes you to bold and empower you in preaching every day of your lives. The Holy Spirit helps you to be courageous. Do you want the Holy Spirit in your life? Do you want God to be in your life? For you to receive the power of the Holy Spirit, you must be a friend of Jesus. Be cleansed in your heart and be holy like Jesus. You must be ready.